What's well, very young, change and we need to talk. So obviously, before the coronavirus and all that, we had supermarkets, and basically people used to shop at supermarkets all the time, and like, we used to just shop there. And if you all may know, there are some annoyances of shopping at the supermarkets, so basically, unfortunately, I'll them all today, because when the coronavirus ends, we can hopefully improve our supermarket behaviour and etiquette, and not the way the following. So these can range from something like standing in the way of the aisle, paying with coins and whatnot, and holding up everything in the queue and things like that, you know? All these little things we cannot do when the coronavirus ends because it is so annoying and I thought I'd show you guys today. If you like this guys, leave a like to you, subscribe to the channel, see you next video. Don't forget to watch the comment down below the videos I want you to next. What you do for you guys, and how far you guys to get into this video. Number one, the person that stands in the way of the aisle. Well, I do appreciate you want to look at the cheapest knockoff brand butter. You do not have to take up the full aisle space to do it. Like, just, you know, step to the side. That's all you have to do. Wow, this like Microsoft looks really good. How much is it? Five pounds ninety nine. Oh my god, I need this. Like, what does it have inside? Um, maybe it's Roland. I don't know. Um, um, I think you're standing in the way of the aisle. Could you possibly just move a bit, a bit past? Can I just possibly move past, please? What do you mean I'm standing in the way of the aisle? Um, well, I can't really get past you because you're standing in the way of the aisle. You've got your like leg, legs spread. I'm trying not for microscope any time. Fine. Like literally how hard is it and what common sense do you have that you can just not move to the side? Like, it's so annoying. Bro, it's just really annoying. Number two, the person who chats with the till person at the till. You know the main point of till is to put yourself onto a till, scan your stuff and go. And that's literally all you have to do is just scan your stuff, pay and go. It is not time to chat and catch up with Brenda on the till talk about minion memes on Facebook. AMG, yeah, so yeah, um, so, um, what's your favourite minion meme on Facebook? Like, yeah, I literally like these, like, funny Facebook minion memes, and basically all my Facebook is full of, like, vaccinations, like, um, sir, can you just, like, can you just, like, please just, like, hurry up the chat a bit, you know, just, like, speed the chat a bit, because just my children waiting to get in the car for me and doing a bit stir crazy, and, you know, just need to speed the process a bit. I'm trying to talk here. I can see you talking, but you need to hurry this talking up. Idiot. You know, you're holding up everybody and you just need to go and scan your things and just leave. I hate that. Number three, so the person who pays all in like pennies or coins or things that way and you can easily use a banknote or a debit card. We're at £2, oh, let me just put this card. £1.50. £1.00. So, do you know like a sort of a debit card you can pay in for like, because you really hold it up the line? Um, yes, I have got money to pay actually. I don't have a debit card, I've got money to pay. You can look, I've got money to pay to be patient. I can pay for this myself. Idiots. <sighs> oh boy. And who does have banknotes? Who does have debit cards or credit cards or whatever? Just pay for those because he's literally holding up every in the queue. Number four now, you got the bossy person. So essentially when you stand in the queue of things like that, they're always critical of how you stand in the queue, like what brand of product you use and things like that. You know what? I don't need your advice. Like I am literally 16 years of age. I do not need teaching how to stand in a line. Oh, excuse me, you like, sound a bit like fur for me thinking much. Okay. I don't know what your problem is. No, you don't just like stand like, you need to, like stand like straight up, you don't just like slouch about when I'm talking to you. I'm standing straight, you don't, you don't need to tell them what to do. You don't, you don't also like just say okay, I thought when you talk to somebody you just like say okay, think they much, you don't just like just go okay. And also next time you're not about processing crap water, get some like different water, get some natural water. It's literally just water. Number five, you got the queue jumper. Just because you're here with five children doesn't mean you can actually jump in a queue. Like, if you're in a queue, you need to get to the back of the queue. Having your kids not an exemption or being special is not an exemption. You're not special with kids or without kids, so get to the back of the queue, y'all. Hi, I'm just gonna jump in the queue. You know, I've got the kid, I've got mouse feeding her. Yeah, I'm just gonna jump in this queue because, you know, I've got kids' mouths to feed and I have to feed her first because my kids need feeding, so I'm gonna jump in this queue because you're not really important. Um, what are you doing in the queue? I've got literally millions of kids here, they're gonna just run around raggy around the store, so you're just gonna let me around the queue. So have I, I need to feed myself. 
You're like really weird. Uh, I feel bad just mentioning these, do not do these. But if you like, like, so yeah, so you guys like to subscribe, shout out to occasion next video. Don't forget to also leave comments as well, which videos you want to do next, if we do for you guys. And don't forget to stay positive and um, look after yourselves against this coronavirus thing. I don't know what to say. Um, goodbye.